picking it out. I got a call. Rumors start floating around that uh, that they were going to go after Dick Edinburgh uh, at NBC, and I knew from Pat Hayden. Pat was doing. Pat had gone to NBC and was doing Notre Dame games with Dick, and we were at a Kentucky Derby, one and only time we've been, and. Uh, uh, Pat was there. Dick was Dick was there. Dick Enberg was, and uh, we have we were in a, a private party and under a tent, and we were dancing. Nancy and I. One of the rare times she got me up out of the chair to to whirl around the dance floor because I got two left feet, and and, and Dick Enberg came. He and his wife Barbara uh, scooted by, and I said. Uh, I think you're doing a great job of doing the Notre Dame games with Pat. And he looked at me disgruntled and said, well, it's not the NFL. I'll guarantee you that. And I thought, oh. Uh, and then Sean McManus called me and he said, uh, uh, though I heard a rumor that, that they were going after Enberg. And I called Sean. He called me back. And he said, no, 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 I don't. I can't imagine He's such a high ticket guy. He's been 35 years at NBC. And then he paused and said, now, in the unlikely event that we hired Dick Enberg, how would you feel about going to the SEC? <laughs> and I said the appropriate things. And I hung up the phone. I looked at Nancy and I said, honey, pack our bags for Tuscaloosa. And sure enough, it happened. And, uh, sure enough, it it was the greatest assignment of my career. I mean, to to be a part uh, of, of the rise of the dominance of this conference, yeah. uh, just extraordinary. And there, in my view, I've I've got a jaundiced view of it, but they're so far ahead of every other conference in the country, and I yeah. hate that we're we're going to give it up. Uh, no, ESPN just had more money than we did. 